<laughs> the baby keeps staring at me. He's like admiring me. What's going on? Good morning, guys. We just woke up literally right now. It's hard waking up every day and still being fucking ugly. We're gonna go ahead and get up and get our morning started because I do have some things to do today and I wanted to bring you guys along with me because I haven't vlogged and I miss it. We're gonna get up and make breakfast. What are you doing? <laughs> I just put up the Christmas tree yesterday and I love how it looks, you guys. It is so cute. I'm going Mickey Mouse themed this year. I still have some things I need to order from Amazon, but for now, this is how my tree's looking. I really need to buy like a tree skirt. Amazon had Mickey ornaments that I wanted to order and a tree skirt. At Walmart has tree skirts of Mickey Mouse and a lot of Mickey Mouse like decorations, but I feel like the the colors won't coordinate with what I wanted to go with. So I have not bought the tree skirt, but Amazon has a few cute ones that are gonna go with the colors and all that. I bought that little Christmas hat at Dollar Tree. Can you guys believe that? Oh, you guys don't sleep on Dollar Tree. Dollar Tree has a lot of cute stuff. We're gonna go to the cellar right now. You don't need that big twin here. Guys, he's he's mad because he can't push this into the door. He was like mad. He was like putting on the one stuff. It's over there. So I bought Adrian a toothbrush already, guys. Um, this is a training toothpaste. I bought it at Target. It has like little Elmo and stuff. He's like, he like puts it in his mouth and then he just puts it around his like teeth. So, you know, and then when he's done with it, he'll just kind of drop it and I'll just pick it up and clean it. But for the most part, he loves it. Like, um, I don't try to force him. I really don't force him to brush his teeth because I feel like the more I push at it, the more I try to do it because I've tried doing it for him and he just like hates it. He will like push me away. I got the Nespresso Virtual Pop Plus and I honestly like it a lot better than the Keurig. And I'm, out of, I'm out of coffee. <laughs> I just realized I have two pots. But um, it's the same thing as it is with the Keurig except that coffee is like 20 times better, you guys. It honestly tastes like, I don't know, Starbucks coffee it's bomb it's just bomb here is the coffee it's always like really milky it's so cool because when you receive the the machine you get samples of different types of coffee so i've been having a different one for the last few weeks and they've all been so good and then i also bought some starbucks ones um, you guys almost so bomb in here too i already made my breakfast so i just made huevo and salchicha on a low carb tortilla i love these tortillas because they actually have flax seeds so they help a lot with fiber and then i have some raspberries here adrian is over here eating already are you eating without me already you're supposed to wait for me pa <laughs> he's like i do not care girl but he's eating the same thing i just put huevo salchicha and raspberries and he has his water okay i'm gonna sit down with adrian so i can eat and this kid is like rushing through his food. He's hungry. Are you doing alright? A little money dump. <laughs> I'm such a badass. Get your greasy finger off my screen, boy. Um, you don't care, huh? You guys, my son brings me the plate when he's done. You're done? Thank you, Papa. Bravo! You want to say bravo? This is the OOTD. I'm just wearing something very casual, very comfortable. We're actually going to go get groceries and then probably hit up Ross or Burlington. We're going to go ahead and go pump gas first. Stop. You're okay. Oh my God, my car's so dirty. I need to wash it. And the gas is 4.03. You're fine, pa. That was like $43, but that's because I already had like half tank. But yeah, we're gonna go ahead and go to Walmart now. It's gonna stop. I was gonna stop and get coffee, but honestly, I think I'm just gonna wait until after Walmart because 
I need it after Walmart. <laughs> I'm gonna need it after Walmart. Adrian's getting fussy and I think it's because he's tired, but I can't let him go to sleep right now because he naps right now. He's gonna go to sleep super early at night. And if you guys are moms, you guys are gonna understand, but I can't let him go to sleep right now. It's really early. It's 1021. We're out pretty early out of the house. Pray for me, you guys, because every time we come to Walmart, it's just expensive. <laughs> everything is like super expensive i get that but a dollar or two dollar makes a big difference so it adds up all right guys we're here at walmart already adrian came all green jeans shoes i found this roaster rack there in the front it was only ten dollars for the turkey so these are honestly really great for you if you have occasional constipation i have it after i had my son but these make me go all the time great product to buy for that you guys I need an eyebrow pencil. The eyebrow pencil I use is pretty affordable. Two twenty eight. I like the Elf one too. It's three dollars, but they don't have a darker shade in Elf, so I think I'm gonna take just the Wet and Wild one. And then I wanted to get this one because this one reminds me of the Dominique one, Dominique Cosmetics, and I heard it's really good. Um, and it reminds me because of the tip of the pencil, but they don't have it in my color neither, which is sad. Because this is really. Cheap too, 328. It's not bad. But yeah, I think we're gonna take just that one. Alright, I am in the clearance section, you guys. If you guys don't check out the clearance section from Walmart, you guys are sleeping on it because they have a bunch of stuff sometimes that's like really good stuff. Right now it doesn't seem like they have a lot of stuff, but like you know, they have like cases like six dollars. Come on now. I don't think they have one for my phone. They're so expensive for my phone. I just got the 15 Pro Max and honestly you guys, I love it. The camera, the picture, the quality, everything is good. But yeah, they have like charging tables. They have like a lot of stuff on sale. So. Earlier I showed you guys my tree. It's a Mickey Mouse tree, but this is what they have at Walmart. I am not a fan of the green. I don't feel like the green, like this is a tree skirt. I don't like the green. The green doesn't go with the vibes, so I'm like. Everything else is so cute. I think I'm gonna go to Burlington and Ross to see if I find anything Mickey Mouse related because they don't even have snow globes here of Mickey Mouse. They have some for the Grinch, but not the Mickey Mouse. So I know I saw some at Burlington last time, so I'm gonna get one for sure for Adrian. Okay, Papa. You like Mickey Mouse? <laughs> He's like, yeah, carry this. He really likes this one. I might just get it for him, I don't know. Look at him, he's just ready to hug it. That's like literally the reality of when people put their phones and they're recording themselves. That's how they look, okay? My cleaning wipes. Great value and me are best friends. Here I am trying to be aesthetic in my phone calls. <laughs> literally. <laughs> He likes to sit when he's in the shopping cart drinking his bottle. Alright guys, I'm gonna get a coffee from McDonald's. You guys don't sleep on coffee from McDonald's because coffee from McDonald's is fire. Your McDonald's app? Um yes, I have the code. Okay. It's six zero six zero. Which company do you want? Could I just get a medium iced vanilla coffee with an extra shot of Nespresso? Okay. And then that's everything. I'll have the Tokopita the first one now. Thank you. Hello. Hi. Thank you. You too. Okay, got my coffee. We're ready to go. These people probably already know me because I come get coffee often. Well, not often. I'm not like a coffee addict that I buy coffee all the time. All right, guys. Got my coffee. Um, but yeah, the vanilla coffee with the extra shot of, of espresso. Oh, my God. It's so fire. You guys can add like whipped cream, caramel drizzle. You can get a sugar-free... I didn't get a sugar-free this time, but 
Um, sugar free is not bad neither. It just tastes like regular. I feel like there's a like this stigma around sugar free products that they don't taste good, but the majority of the sugar free products that I've tried have been pretty good, honestly. I'm not gonna lie. Like Dutch Bros sugar free coffees, the McDonald's sugar free coffees. I have whipped cream at home that's sugar free for my coffee. It's, it it tastes just the same. And then like the Italian cream creamer sugar free tastes just like the regular uh the regular Italian cream one. Alright guys. My baby's sleeping. I have to get Adrian some shoes. And they have a bunch of them, but the cute ones aren't his size, so. I don't know. <laughs> I found these. These are cute. These are like going out shoes type of thing. But they're like wide, which he has a wide foot, so it's kind of hard to get him a shoe but they're size six he's a size five and these don't tie or anything so it's nice because he'll just slip his foot in and they're kind of cute you know to like for like dressy shoes because he has regular shoes for every day but he needs dressy shoes and i can't find any cuter ones than those so i think i gotta take those because i don't want to struggle oh they have these too these look a little weird <laughs> i don't know it's kind of ugly so I just got out of Burlington a little bit ago. I'll show you guys what I got when I get home. But honestly, you guys, I was going to go to Dollar Tree. But after seeing all these cops, I was like, hell no. Oh, hell no. Well, I don't know what happened here, but there's literally like three cops, four cops. And some of them have like their trunk open. And I don't know. All I can think about is that they either are getting things to like stock up on something like an event at the Dollar Tree or literally they probably just found somebody um they probably found somebody stealing last time i had came to the dollar tree i was literally inside and somebody ran out with a bunch of stuff like on a basket like they ran out and the person that was helping me the cashier girl she literally ran out right after him and she was just like pissed i was like bro this is so ghetto we live in the ghetto i'm in the ghetto <laughs> I feel like I'm in the ghetto. Have you guys seen that meme? That meme is so funny. But yeah, I'm here at Burger King because I'm gonna get my baby some chicken nuggets so he can eat before we actually go do the grocery shopping. He's crying right now because he's hungry. So see you guys at Winko. Hi guys, we're at Winko. Foods are ready. <laughs> Why does my son look like a little bonito? So cute. You guys, they have these little bowls, salsa bowls. I'm gonna take one because they're so cute. And they're only 98 cents, so they're so cute. I'm gonna go ahead and get some of these C4s because my husband loves them. And then I've been really obsessed with these, so I'm gonna take a few of these too. They're really good, you guys. I haven't tried this one, but this one's really good. The watermelon, the berry one's good. They have another one, um, tropical something. It's pretty good too, so. Okay, guys, if you guys want an alternative for hot Cheetos, these are it baked hot cheetos bomb so i'm finally home i'm so happy i'm home already i literally spent all day out in la calle i'm gonna go ahead and put all the groceries away i'm gonna show you guys what i got because there's a lot of things it might look like a little bit but trust me i stuffed those bags and i got a lot of stuff for thanksgiving already which i wanted to get that out of the way because i know stores are gonna be so hectic if i go last minute so i'm not even gonna go through that I'm gonna save myself a hassle, a headache, and everything. So I just got everything I needed right now. I'm gonna show you guys like a few of the healthy alternative options I've had or I've um, switched over to that probably will help somebody if they are in a weight loss journey because I'm still in the journey. I took like a month and a half off of the gym and you guys, my body felt it. My body felt it, I felt it in my clothes. I felt a lot more bloated. I just felt so bad, like so out of shape so as you guys can see it's like a bunch of bags and then i got more over here i got like celery i got these little mini wheats mini wheats maybe you don't like them i don't know kodiak i got salad bags that pineapple's looking at me like it wants me to cut it already oh my god it's so yellow i really need to cut that today though so i am gonna do that today but i got some of this stuffing mix they have it in box too but i oh, it has a seasoning packet Oh, I didn't see that. Anyways, yeah, but I'm going to make stuffing for one of the turkeys. I also have another bag here that I had bought from Walmart. It's just like a bunch of like 
like the snacks for adrian and stuff like that i ended up buying these little cute shoes for adrian they're a size bigger than his like regular size or size six but i think he'll be fine because they'll last through you know new years and christmas and then i also bought him this really cute plaid shirt for christmas or for thanksgiving so he is gonna wear this he's gonna wear some dressy tan pants and then he's gonna wear these so he's gonna look so cute i also bought these because i'm gonna make the mac and cheese and the potato salad the potato salad i'm gonna do it at my mother-in-law's because we're gonna leave for thanksgiving early in the morning so i'm gonna take one of them over there and then the other one i'm gonna make the mac and cheese that day early in the morning that way we don't need to be you know using the oven and the turkey's gonna take up the oven the whole time so these are really good like to use for like as pre-workout that's what i usually use it as because honestly pre-workout for me it's like hard to not find one that makes me feel shaky so these are really good i got the ki kiwi guava wild berry watermelon and the tropical vibe one which is super good this one's really good i haven't tried the kiwi guava i'm not a fan of guava so i'm kind of nervous i got some cooking spray i think i said it in one of the other videos but i love using cooking spray um the avocado oil or the olive oil works um but yeah i like to cook with this sometimes i will cook with oil it'll be like olive oil and it's very little got these you guys saw it winkle these are really good you guys as a snack they're baked they're 50 percent less fat than the actual hot cheetos that's what the back says and i'm gonna believe it because they're bomb <laughs> yogurt some greek yogurt this is a winkle brand i I think i tried it before and it's pretty good it's not bad you guys i bought the little salsa bowl this is so cute for when i make salsa or even pico de gallo or guacamole mm. if you guys love pancakes waffles stuff like that you guys need to try this brand the kodiak brand is really healthy for you guys i love it because it's really high in protein it has 15 grams of protein for every half cup which is really good i just bought like a bunch of meats like I have turkey bacon already in the fridge, so that's a good alternative to switch over from like regular bacon. I eat a lot of like chicken, I eat shrimp. You guys, I could eat like chicken and shrimp like for the whole week and I'd be okay. I also bought some croutons because I love having a salad after the gym sometimes. I also bought beef jerky to snack on and turkey jerky. So this is probably gonna be mine. This is probably gonna be my husband's, but turkey jerky. I've never tried it, but we're gonna check it out and we're gonna see if it's good because it, I mean, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be good. It's beef jerky. The only difference is that it's lighter than the beef one. Guys, I already started cutting up my limones. What happened, pa? I'm gonna start exprimiendolos in a bowl because I have to wait for my shrimp to thaw out. I didn't want to thaw them out since earlier because I didn't want them to get like, to go bad because I was gonna be gone for a while, so. But my child is being a menace right now. Grabbing all the ornaments from the tree because I lit it on, I put it on. And he grabbed like a bunch of them. He's taking a bunch of ornaments off. Which I'm surprised because he didn't do any of that yesterday when I was putting up the tree. So now I'm like, what's going on, Chucky? <laughs> Literally. Yeah, it's like a Chucky sometimes. I'm like, bro, 15 to 20 for that pound of medium shrimp. So I'm going to go ahead and just do this. And then I'll show you guys the next step right now. I keep looking at myself with the camera and I always think I'm looking straight at the camera, but I'm looking at myself, guys. Sorry, I'm a little conceited. <laughs> this is how it is. I have to look at myself to see how I look. Sometimes I feel like I look funny on the camera. That's part of the reason why I don't vlog as much anymore, because I don't know, sometimes you get like really self-conscious. Okay, guys, this is 15 limes. It's like right there on this bowl. It's not dirty, I promise. It's just scratched. I'm going to go ahead and put the huachilas in this thing. I don't know why it has a little thing, I think, from the mark of the sticker because it had a sticker on there and i rinsed it this is the shrimp so i'm gonna make a pound of this medium-sized shrimp so i'm just gonna butterfly them
vlog and I really hope that you guys keep watching my videos and I really hope that I keep posting videos. If you guys need to harass me, harass me please. No, I'm kidding. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I'm so excited to keep making content for you guys. I hope you guys subscribe, like, comment down below. Tell me what your day consists of if you're a stay-at-home mom. Um, tell me what your favorite thing about the vlog was. What's your favorite coffee? I don't know. Leave me a comment. Leave me something there, you know? I hope you guys enjoyed this video, like I said. And I'm going to go ahead and close it out right now. And thank you guys so much for watching. We'll see you guys on the next video. Bye!